Hey YouTube, it's Wes Koya. I just thought I'd make a quick video showing how you can get out of recovery mode if you have a broken power button or home button. Now, if you're like me, you have an iPhone here with a broken power button or home button, you can't press the buttons to get out of the mode. So you see it's stuck in recovery mode, and you think that you can't get out of it unless you restore the iPhone. But there's actually an, another way that you know most people know about, but if you don't, well then you're gonna find out in a second. Now you're gonna have to have a computer, obviously, but you're not going to be restoring it. You're going to be doing something else. Now you're going to have to have a, pro a program called, um, it's called Tiny Umbrella. I'm just going to search up here so you can see it. Yeah, it looks like this. If I, my iPhone will focus here. Come on. It looks like that. It has like a basket with like a little umbrella. Alright, well, from there on, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to plug up your iPhone with the uh, cable you got here. I'm pretty sure this works on the iPhone 5 and 5S and 5C. There's no reason why it shouldn't. And then you plug the other end obviously into your USB port. Come on. Hit a little bong and it opens up iTunes as quickly as possible which you know it gives you the option making you think that the only way you can get out is you know to obviously restore it but you know since we can't get out of it the manual way with the buttons we're gonna have to do this you go into here you type in the program tiny umbrella it's a free download if you want to get the program okay open it up I'm opening up the newest one I got here 7.2 um, wants you to accept the policy or whatnot I'm just gonna want to do that or else it won't work this is a Java program, so it's going to have this needing to load up, and there we go. Okay, so you see on the top here, it'll say recovery devices, and then you'll see one that has a whole bunch of numbers. That doesn't mean that anything's wrong with your device at all, it's just a way of describing the device. So, you know, that, that is your device, there's nothing wrong with it, and that's how it should be. It should be just a combination of numbers. Uh, most of the time at least so once you click on that over here the options will be highlighted um, you know to fix recovery or exit recovery but since that it knows that the iPhone is in recovery mode it gives us that option to get out of it so I'm just gonna try showing you that it's in recovery mode and I'm gonna try to hit the button so you can see exactly what will happen um, at the same time if I can't even do that Okay, so here we go. Hit it now. Now you can see immediately it went out of the uh, recovery mode. And now it should be booting up as it should, you know, um, normally. Providing that there's no other issues, which I don't think there would be. Let's give it some time. You can already tell by uh, the way that the screen lit up that it's working. It just vibrated, indicating that it's plugged in, and the screen should show up in a second here. And there we go. So let me just focus this in a bit better. You can see it's working. Oh, well, it is working. And it's asking to trust this computer. So, you see that does work, and um, yeah, so if your buttons don't work, that's how you can get out of it, and you never really have to actually restore your iPhone if it's on that screen, just so you know, because most people think from the warning on iTunes that that's the only way you can get out, and it is definitely not. So, there you go, hope you enjoyed, and I hope this was helpful to whoever is in a situation where they need this done. Thanks for watching.